Six ways to improve your Pinterest strategy. Hey Pinners, Michelle Held from Pintalk.net. I'm gonna give you six ways to improve your Pinterest strategy. Follow me on my, my website, Pintalk.net. Of course, follow me on Pinterest as well, where I give you Pinterest tips, tricks, tutorials, and a lot of Pinterest for business. I put all of my blog posts and videos on Twitter, Pintalk.net. And of course, if you like this video, please hit the like button below, subscribe to my channel, and then you'll get updates when I post new videos. So six ways to improve your Pinterest strategy. Super important if you're using Pinterest for business or if you wanna build a following. So the first thing you could do is complete your profile. You see lots of profiles out there with uh, maybe sort of silly wording or goofy wording and it's not relevant. If you're a business or brand, it's not very acceptable. You need to tell people what you're about and have a clear profile image there as well and verify your account, change it to a Pinterest or business account if you are a business or a brand. Second one is work on increasing your following. You can't just go up there and blah, 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 put a bunch of pins about your products and services up. You actually have to actively work on increasing your following. That means engaging with the other pinners asking for people to follow your Pinterest account from your other social profiles, assuming you have bigger followings there, uh, leaving comments on other people's pins, inviting them to like your board or follow your boards, and just being an active member of the community the same way you would on any other social media channel as you're participating rather than just posting. Uh, join a group board. So joining group boards is a way to increase your following. If you're a brand, you have to be careful here because you don't want to join a lot of boards. You remember, you don't have full control over them. So if they get spammy or have some uh, rather undesirable content, you don't want to be associated with that. None of us really want to be associated with that. So just be very careful with group boards that you have the time to actually monitor what's being posted there and making sure it's still a good fit for your brand. Uh, pin at popular times. So if you put your pins up at popular times, um, more people are gonna be online and present or on their smartphones to actually see what you're posting because things go by fast in the feeds. Popular times include the weekends. We have seen that pinners like to be on at work sometimes. And of course, later in the evening after dinner is done, kids are to bed. So let's try to stick to those popular times or maximize the number of pins you put up at those times to get more eyeballs on your content. Uh, leaving comments on boards, where I said that in the beginning about increasing your following. Leave comments on other people's boards. Uh, you could ask them to join. You could just uh, comment on their photos, uh, suggest similar things that you have that they might be interested in. And you could also use uh, send messages to other Pinterest users as well. And then number six, use popular topics on Pinterest. We know popular topics on Pinterest, similar to Etsy as well, uh, home decor, fashion, weddings, uh, jewelry, so do it yourself, and any kind of home project. Those are very popular topics on Pinterest. And if that's not your business category, you can certainly find a way for yourself to fit in. Home Depot does a wonderful job of making themselves fit into the very popular categories on Pinterest. They incorporate food into their pin boards and they do that by uh, featuring their grills, right? And their outdoor living and they can work in recipes and food photos, which are, are the popular topics, whereas uh, barbecue is not exactly the most popular. So they do a really nice job and then of course they can bring in home decor and do it yourself because that's who they are. So that's a good example to look at. You're thinking like, how am I ever gonna fit into those popular categories? You can make it work. Uh, so those are your ways to improve your Pinterest strategies, to get more following, get more people to look at your pins and increase your presence on social media. Follow me on my website, pintalk.net, for more Pinterest tips, tricks, and tutorials, and of course, Pinterest for business. Follow me on Pinterest as well. If you liked this video and found it helpful, please hit the like button below and subscribe to my channel, and then check out my Pinterest account and Twitter as well for more blog posts and videos. Carry on, pinners.